some people think that in today's world getting old is entirely bad however other people believe that the lives of older people are much better now than they were in the past discuss both points of view and express your own opinion with the advancement in technology life expectancy has improved in many parts of the world some people feel that now the elderly live a good life as compared to the past however some believe that in today's world getting old is entirely harmful in my opinion the elderly work with more enthusiasm and energy these days which was not possible in the past to begin with some people continue to contribute to society even after retirement in one way or another it was not possible in the past due to a scarcity of facilities now many old people do volunteer work after getting retired because they feel that it is better to work instead of sitting idle even in many fields including bollywood many people above the age of 60 years work actively for example amitabh bachchan who is around 80 years old is actively doing movies like a youngster medical facilities have advanced and diseases are cured very easily these days moreover old people stay fit because they continue to work and enjoy all the facilities on the other hand some people believe that it is not good to get old as youngsters don't look after them they are of the view that the young generation is busy in their day to day life and they do not get to spend time with their parents and grandparents as a result they start feeling lonely at some stage of their life and get deprived of love moreover they do not get the required medical attention especially in nuclear families because no one stays at home due to their professional commitments apart from this they miss the emotional bond with their family if they live in an old age home to conclude the elderly live a good life these days as compared to the past because of the increased awareness and advancement in medicine besides they stay fit because they continue to engage themselves in small tasks schools are no longer needed because children can find so much information on the internet and study at home to what extent do you agree or disagree with this essay the growth of the internet has questioned the existence of schools as some people believe that there is no need for schools at a time when students can learn and study at home with the help of the internet in my opinion i completely disagree with the statement as no one can replace school education in a child's life to begin with the role of school education is very crucial for the overall development of children without any doubt schools shape students future in this competitive world though everything is available on the internet schools assess the minds of students and accordingly teach them in other words teacher clear the concepts of students as per their understanding levels which is not possible on the internet in schools teachers give extra attention to weak students so that they can do well in exams their main goal is to build their foundation and work towards strengthening it for example every student has their own grasping power and teachers help students sharpen it moreover two way interaction is very useful and interesting which helps students understand topics easily on the other hand the internet has made life very easy be it students or professionals as far as students are concerned they can explore anything on the internet these days online lectures have become very popular 
Many students like to read online because the internet gives several options while letting students stay in their comfort zone. Besides, as vast information and knowledge is available on the internet, some people believe that there is no need to go to school. To conclude, though technology has seen rapid advancement, the conventional method of teaching holds immense importance. Even in the coming 50 years, the school model cannot be replaced. Even during the pandemic, the parents felt that school education was the best way to make students acknowledgeable and intelligent.